You know, there are people in this world that don't have to put up with all this shit. Like that guy that invented the pet rock. You see, that's what you have to do. You have to use your mind and come up with some really great idea like that, and you can make millions, never have to work again. You think the pet rock was a really great idea? Sure it was. The guy made a million dollars. You know, I had an idea like that once, a long time ago. Really? What was it, Tom? Well, all right. It was a jump to conclusions, Matt. You see, it would be this mat that you would put on the floor and would have different conclusions written on it that you could jump to. That is the worst idea I've ever heard in my life, Tom. Yes, yes, it's horrible, this idea. Ah, look, uh, I gotta get out of here. I'll see you guys later. If I still have a job. You know, this is always one of my favorite segments of the show because I never know quite what they're going to be bringing out here. <laughs> oh, look what they are bringing out here. Oh, well, Hello there. Dino. Hello, Dino. Dino. Oh, my gosh, he is huge. Yes, but don't let Dino's looks fool you. He's really gentle as a lamb. That's a result of being raised in captivity. Well, that's why we're able to bring him out here. Uh -huh. is, is this a rare animal? Yes, it is, Frank. Uh, as a matter of fact, we're having trouble mating him. You're having trouble finding a female for Dino? <laughs> well, no, not really. We've matched Dino up with several likely candidates on a number of occasions. The trouble is that all efforts at reproduction have been unsuccessful. Oh, I can hardly believe that. After all, Dino here may, may not be the handsomest suitor I've ever seen, <laughs> but certainly a big gorilla like this. Well, we're not really sure yet what the trouble is with Dino. Uh, it could just be shyness, a natural reluctance, or even what we would call impotence. Impotent? <laughs> Whoa. 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 Okay, it's now 24 after the hour and time for a review of the morning's top story with Tom LeClaire. Moscow in flames, missiles headed toward New York. Film at 11. Guard number one is a senior on Klons Mountain and aspires to be a research chemist. Welcome, please, Hung Well. Guard number two is a real skating buff. A warm welcome for Long Wang. <laughs> Traveling comes naturally to guard number three as he's a licensed airplane pilot. Welcome, please, enormous genitals. <laughs> 